Hi everyone, welcome back to a new video. If you're new here, my name is Anushka. So, today we're going to be trying out some new lippies. These are from L'Oreal. They are the Rouge Signature. Rouge Signature Lip Inks. I have a few shades here that they've sent me and I wanted to try them on camera. I know you guys love like lip swatch videos. I think it's just satisfying to see like each colour on my skin tone because I don't know like there's only a few people I know online that have kind of the similar skin tone to me so I don't know I personally love lip swatch videos and I think a lot of you message me saying that you um, find it really helpful to see them on my skin tone so it just makes everyone happy then it so so apparently with this one it coats your lips in long-lasting pigments for more color intensity whilst the ultra thin film technology uses an oil and water formulation which enables your lips to breathe for a bare skin feel so you're free to make an impression without leaving a trace Less is more, less texture, more colour impact. Which is true because I've been, it's so weird, I've been staying away from like matte liquid lipsticks lately because my skin, my lips are so dry. Let's start with a shade that really, really did stand out to me which is called I Achieve. This is what this one looks like. So you can get that really precise application with that pointy bit. Right, so this is the first one which is called Achieve. Now, I don't know if you can tell, you can still see the pigmentation on my lips. I have quite dark pigmentation on my lips, which is fine, it's all good. It still looks pigmented and when you apply it, it's really like, you feel that it's watery, but it's so comfortable. The only way I can explain this is that it feels like a lip stain. I don't know, I just love it. If you want something that's going to completely cover your lips and that you want super pigmentation, maybe this is not for you. Um, you you're best going with like... Soup like the Huda Beauty Demi Matte or a, a straight up liquid lipstick. The microwave was on this whole time, but anyways. But yeah, this is definitely more like watery, but still quite hydrating. And it does transfer a slight bit, but yeah, it feels mostly like a lip stain. So this one is I Achieve. The next one is called... I represent which is kind of like a really pinky tone red almost like a fuchsia color so I don't know if you can tell see that you can still see that pigment but the color is still quite bright so yeah this one is I represent look how that stains my lips The next one's called I Stand. I'm living for the names of these. This one I don't think is going to be up my street because it's quite like of a smoky greyish colour. Okay, so this is the next one. I'm not mad at it. But, you know, if this is your type of colour, it's actually not bad. I'm actually quite shocked at the pigmentation, even though it's like more of a lip stain. They're so comfortable as well. On to the next one. We're gonna go with a classic red, which is called I Am Worth It. So this is I Am Worth It. It's actually so stunning. I've got one, look how that, I mean, I could just walk out the door like that and it just looks like I've got lipstick on. So next one, I'm not sure it will really suit me. I think with the stain underneath, it kind of works, but it's definitely not my type. I think my favourite one is the orange and the reds. But yeah, this one is called Eye Saver. I think if you're paler and you like a baby pink stain... This could actually complement your natural lip colour really nicely. I mean, actually when it dries down, it dries to a stain. Because it's literally barely transferring right there. So, like, if you want longevity and a good stain, I had like mascara on my eyes, didn't I, this whole time. It's alright. If you want um, 
a nice stain that's gonna last and you're gonna eat and stuff i think this is really good these are 9.99 i think if there's a really nice color that really is attracting to you it's not it's not bad the packaging's really nice the formula is very lightweight breathable non-drying it's a nice stain and it gives quite a lot of pigment for what it is um but yeah if you want something that's going to completely cover your lips this is not going to be for you because you can still see pigmentation through but if you want something that's just going to give a bit of color and you know you're not going to worry about it staining all day like transferring it actually don't like when it dries it doesn't but i also did put a little bit of this if you're going to put a lot it does transfer a little bit yeah so yeah if you find a really nice color that's appealing to you I think it's no it's not bad you know but again like if you if I were to try these way back when I just love liquid lipsticks and I want a full pigment onto on all my lips I wouldn't have liked these but because lately I just wear stuff that just enhances my natural lips these I'm not mad at these so it really depends on the person anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this quick lip swatch video give it a big thumbs up if you did and if you want more that will also let me know if you want more um but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I love you guys and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!